In this video, we'll show you how to set up your new Garmin Descent G2 Series dive computer. Before setting up the dive computer, Garmin recommends charging your device for two and a half hours before heading out to your dive. Now, press the light button on the top left to power on your dive computer. The Descent G2 has a touchscreen that can be used to select, scroll back, or up and down through menus. During this video, we will be using the buttons, but you can use the touchscreen instead. Use the up and down buttons to scroll through the language options. Then, press the Start Stop button on the upper right to select your language. Next, we'll pair your compatible smartphone with your dive computer. Select the green check mark to begin. Using your smartphone's camera, scan the QR code. If you already have the Garmin device application on your smartphone, scanning this code will direct you to the device search screen. For new customers, scanning the code will direct you to install the Garmin Dive application. Once the download is complete, open the Garmin Dive app. Select Sign In if you already have a Garmin Dive account. To create a new account, select Create Account, then agree to the Terms and Conditions. Select Next. Once prompted, select Connect a Garmin device to connect the app with your dive computer. Then allow the Garmin Dive app access to your smartphone's camera. Now scan your dive computer's QR code. Select Connect it when the dive app recognizes your dive computer. Your dive computer will now display a six-digit code. Confirm it with the Garmin Dive app. Select Pair. Allow the Descent G2 access to your smartphone's notifications. Then follow the on-screen prompts to set up your user preferences. To finish the dive computer setup, read through the terms and conditions. Then press the Down button to accept. Now that your Descent G2 and smartphone are paired, your dive computer will display the watch face with the date and time. Now let's talk about the button overview of your new Descent G2 dive computer. It has five buttons. Each button can be pressed or held for different actions. The dive computer bezel has labels for many of these functions. Let's start with the light control button on the top left of your Descent G2 dive computer. Pressing and holding this button will power on your device. While your dive computer is on, pressing this button will turn the screen on or off. Holding this button will open the controls menu. Here you'll have quick access to frequently used functions such as do not disturb mode, the battery saver feature, pool mode, and turning the dive computer off. To learn more about this feature, see our shortcuts video. Let's move to the Start Stop button on the top right of the dive computer. Pressing this button will open the Activities and Apps list. We will cover the Activity list later in this video. You can also press the Start Stop button to select on-screen options. Next, let's talk about the Back button located on the lower right of the dive computer. Pressing this button will return you to the previous screen. Hold the back button to view previously opened activities, menus, and settings. Pro tip, touch the clock at the top of the screen to return to the watch face. The down button is on the bottom left of the dive computer. Press this button to scroll through the glance loop and menus. To learn more about your glance loop, see our customizing the watch face and widget loop video. Hold this button to view the altimeter, barometer, and compass, also known as the ABC screen. The Up menu button is on the middle left side of the dive computer. Press this button to scroll through menus, such as the glance loop. Hold this button to view the menu. From the menu, you can customize the watch face, adjust settings, and pair wireless sensors. Press the Start Stop button to get to your activity list. The Descent G2 Series Dive Computer will have a preset list of activities that align with diving. However, you can always scroll to the bottom of the list and select Add. 
Here, you can select additional activities for your activities list. Lastly, let's talk about diving with your new dive computer. From the activities and app screen, select a dive type that you would like to start. The dive pre-check screen will list the default dive setup. You can either select confirm or press the up button to make adjustments to the dive setup. Once finished, press the back button until you return to the dive pre-check screen. Press the start stop button to confirm your settings. Your Descent G2 dive computer will now look for satellites and mark your entry point. The dive will start once you reach 1.2 meters or 4 feet underwater. The GPS will turn off. It will re-enable once you resurface. During your dive, you can press the up and down buttons to scroll over data screens. Press the start stop button to access dive settings. Once you resurface, your Descent G2 Dive computer will display a countdown in the upper left. If safe and able, you can start a second dive. After the time runs out, the dive will end. You can stop the dive at any time in the settings menu. Garmin also recommends cleaning your dive computer after a water sport or dive activity. And that's it, your Garmin Descent G2 Series Dive Computer is now set up. To learn more about your dive computer, please subscribe to our Garmin Support YouTube channel and visit support.garmin.com. Thanks for watching.